In WPF apps, you might want to resize controls at runtime. For example, when you create some template for a form. In this video, I'm going to show you how to resize WPF controls at runtime. Now, let's open the C Sharp solution in Visual Studio and go to mainwindow.xaml. First, we need to define the style for our WPF panel and the resizer which is used to resize the panel. Next, create a canvas control that contains grid and data grid and define some columns in it. In the generic.xaml file, we add the template for the resizer class in our scenario. Let's open the resizer.cs file. We create a custom thumb control resizer class which is inherited from the thumb class to help resize the pen. In this class, we first create the resizer directions. Here we use an enumerable resize direction to enumerate the resizable direction. And every direction has a method to define the resize operation. Next, we call the exact resize method in the resizer drag delta function when resize operation took place. We implement a switch statement in the case of a different resizing direction. Okay, now let's see how the code actually works. Let's build the WPF app project. For the app is loaded, you can use the blue border to resize the panel. Your mouse and drag the control in the directions to best display the panel. When you're done, you'll get the resized WPF panel at runtime. 